Hi, so uh, this is uh, more for adults. Uh, I'm going to be reading The Last Temptation of Christopher Robin by Michael O'Brien. The original script I had uh, when we did it at the uh, National Arts Centre and then the Cross Canada Tour. The Last Temptation of Christopher Robin, Part 1, Scene 1, in which Christopher Robin goes away to war and takes Pooh and Piglet along with him. England, 1940. Christopher Robin's bedroom at morning. Pooh and Piglet are sitting by the bed, looking forlorn. Pooh. Oh, bother. Piglet. Well, what's the matter, Pooh? It seems that Christopher Robin has gotten up without us again. Oh, dear. He often gets up without us these days. He never says good morning to us in the morning or good night to us at night, and I do wish he would. Well, Pooh, I expect that he might be busy. Busy? Yes, boys often are at his age, I'm told. But busy with what? Oh, I don't know important things, I expect. Christopher Robin is nearly 19, and that's very old indeed. But I'm nearly that age myself, and I don't get any busier. Well, Pooh, that's because you're a bear, I expect, and uh, he's not. All the same, I, I do wish he'd say good morning. Oh, here he comes. Here comes Christopher Robin now. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Enter Christopher Robin. He is wearing a World War II uniform. It's a long way to Tipperary. It's a long way to go. It's a long way to Tipperary to the sweetest girl I know. So goodbye, Piccadilly. Farewell, Leicester Square. It's a long, long way to Tipperary, but my heart's right there. Good morning, Pooh. Hello, Piglet. Good morning, Christopher Robin. Oh, good morning, Christopher Robin. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to get prepared. Oh, Christopher Robin is wearing a green outfit. Yes, I noticed that too. Why is Christopher Robin wearing a green outfit? Perhaps we should ask him why. Yes, I'll ask him why. Oh, Christopher Robin. Yes, Pooh. Uh, uh, you look very smart in that green outfit, I thought I should say. Well, thank you, Pooh. Piglet and I were wondering where we might be able to get some ourselves. Uh, that way we could all wear green outfits when we go on our treasure hunts. Silly bear, you can't wear a uniform like this. I can't? No, no, it's, a, it's a, an army uniform. Only men like me can wear it. And anyway, we can't go on any more treasure hunts because I have to go away. Go away? Where to, Christopher Robin? To war, Pooh. To where? To war. I'm a soldier now, and I'm going to fight the Germans a long way across the channel. Is that outside of the Hundred Acre Wood, Christopher Robin? Yes, Piglet, it's very, very far away. Oh, my. Why don't you take us with you, Christopher Robin? Oh, Pooh, I can't. Why not? I just got It's very dangerous, you see. A lot of Germans are running around with guns. Why, I should very much like to see a German. Well, I don't think he'd like to see you. Oh. Christopher Robin? Yes, Piglet? What's a German? A German Piglet is a bad man with a gun. That's who I'm going down there to fight. Oh, my. So, you see, dear Pooh and Piglet, I can't bring you along. Well, when are you coming back, Christopher Robin? Well, I'm not sure. They say before Christmas. Christmas? Well, that's a long time, Christopher Robin. We'll miss you, Christopher Robin. Yes, Christopher Robin. It just won't be the same without you. Who's going to lead us on our expeditions and keep us safe from the heifer lumps? Things will be terrible and sad without you, Christopher Robin. Now, Pooh Piglet, listen. I have to fight in the army. That's my duty. You'll have to do all those things by yourselves until I get back. But what, what if you never come back, Christopher Robin? What? What if something 
happens to you, Christopher Robin? What if we never see you again? Take us with you, Christopher Robin. Yes, take us with you, Christopher Robin. We could sneak into the army. We could hide. Yes, Christopher Robin, you could smuggle us in. Think of all the jolly times we have, setting traps for Germans and then letting them go. Oh, do take us with you, Christopher Robin, please. Oh, dear. I do love you both. We love you too, Christopher Robin. Oh, dear. No, I, I, I mustn't. I have a bad feeling. You two must stay here. We shan't come to any harm, Christopher Robin, if that's what you're thinking. We'll be very careful. Yes, we won't be discovered. We're very small and good at hiding. I'm very quiet too, if no one steps on me. Please, Christopher Robin, please take us. Oh, please. Oh, bother. I thought I'd get out of this easier, but I do love you too, too much. You must promise never to let anyone see you, ever, ever. We promise, we promise, Christopher Robin. Oh, Pooh, oh, Piglet, no one else believes in you, but I do. When we're together, we can do anything. I'll never forsake you. Not even a war can keep us apart. Come on now, we have to catch a train. Hooray! Oh, men everywhere, everywhere have to go off to fight. Hitler's been misbehaving, and you know that's not right. When the battle is over, we can be friends again. But right now we're enemies, enemies, simply because we're men. Oh, men, men, all dressed in uniform, doing the glorious thing. Marching all in formation, led by a noble king. We shall punish our enemies, they'll not be bad again. This is what God demands of us, simply because we're men. Oh, men, men, marching through history, oh, what a thing to be. There have been millions of others, so now there is also me. I shall die for my country if I possibly can. Well, my name is Christopher Robin. I'm proud to be a man. Oh, yes, I'm, my name is Christopher Robin. I'm proud to be a man. He's proud to be a man. He's proud to be a man. Scene one. Done.